Okay, we are arriving at our friend Marcy's house. We're going to help her and learn how to inspect her new bees. Hello. Hello. And here is my friend Marcy. Hi, Marcy. Hi. And here's her puppies. Puppies. Hi, puppies. Okay, well, the, the big thing that you need to remember when you open this up is, one, you always want to slide all the frames to one side or the other before you start looking. If you don't, okay. if you don't, you won't have enough room when you pull a frame, and you'll roll what we call roll the queen, and you'll roll other bees too. What happens is it's too tight in there. You lift it, Ooh, you I can saw roll it, and kill her. Saddlebags going in. Second, you want to try and you got your hood ready. I'm going to throw a hood on real quick. Okay, I'll just throw a mosquito mask on. I don't need full gear or anything like that. These are really nice bees, so... The last bees. time you remembered. Ah, uh, they're good bees. <laughs> we can see what's going on. Okay, you want to take a little bit of this in here, and you just want to put it in the bottom like so. And just start with a little bit, okay? They'll back off here in a second anyhow. Now what I want you to do is, I want you to put the lighter in the bottom, and light the bottom of that, and make sure you get the fire in the bottom. This has, you have to think of a force full of fire. It starts at the bottom, you have to push it real forward. I always tell my wife, you got to be smarter than what you work with. <laughs> Honestly. Don't hit me. I know you're a doctor. Okay, once you get that going, shove this down in there. Okay. And then just puff it. Now puff on it a few times. So you get it moving. There you go. Push it down in there. Get it out of your face. Woo. Yeah, you're going to get smoked out. Okay, Sorry. Okay, I want you to drop this. Now look, we're going to drop don't a smoke. manure in there. I, we okay. don't either, so I know. Uh -huh. That manure will go right on top. And it follows you. Pull the highball and just step to the side. Right there you go. Pull the hive off, and I want you to just take a look at the, underneath the cover as you take it off. There you go. Just swing it up in your hands, dear. Hi, guys. No, 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 no. We don't slide. We don't slide. Don't. The reason is because you're going to smash a bee. As soon as you smash that first bee, the scent goes up. And that's when they say, hey, somebody's here okay. trying to take us out. Now, this is the top cover. We're just, this is usually propolis down. You're just going to pop it under the corner here. There you go. And just give it a little pop. That's it. Raise the cover. Set it down in the same way. Make sure you look underneath it. We want to make sure we don't take the queen out with it. Because she could be up there. You never know where she's going to okay, be. It's okay, That came loose with it. It'll all come loose. Lift, lift it toward you. No, no, no. Lift it toward you so you can see if there's a queen on the bottom of that. There we go. We don't see a queen, so we lay that down. Okay. Now, this is a pretty easy method. This all got shifted in the run. Normally, we would push all this this way, okay? I want you to pull this first frame. You're going to have to take this. We never work from the center. We always work from the edge, so where the frame is tough, and break it loose like that, okay? Okay. So we're going to go ahead and remove that first frame. There's nothing in it. Not a smoker, are you, dear? <laughs> there you go. Now, same thing with the next one. Break it loose at the corners. If it's loose already, you don't have to break it loose. And just take it out and set it next to that little frame down there. There you go. Nothing on it, so we're, we're good to go. But you got to do a little bit faster. You can't keep looking at the frame. Well, I'm trying to get that one. Don't worry about to... that one. It's okay. That one we got a million of them in there. We won't. We won't. Now we're going to just start leaving the frames in. We're just going to slide them this way, okay? Now you just go ahead and break it loose. There you go. I'm going to stand on this side, okay? Okay. Yeah, you want to not, no jerky movements. Just leave it down. We're just going oh, to slide yeah. it this way. Same thing. Break it loose. Oh, we got some nice comb. Yes, we do. Got some nice uh, cedar frames in there, too. Mm -hmm. Now, what I'm going to do is, I don't want to smoke them, but I want to put a little smoke up next to us, okay? So I'll set the smoker up, just so it throws a little smoke that way. All right, now here's what we want to do. Yeah, make sure when you pull this. Now we're going to look at this. Watch your head. That's a honey frame. Okay. Now that honey frame is being drawn out on one side, and there's the other. They're capping it. Capping. Draw, drawn yeah, out means they're building the comb on exactly. the other side, huh? Yeah, and they're 50% capped on the other. Now, once again, we want to put this down in here. See how I'm handling the ends? We want to put that down. We want to make sure we gently put it down because they will get underneath it. And then we slide it over. We got plenty of bee space. 
the next frame. You have to break it loose. You always try to just move the frame. Yeah, there you go. Now, pick that up. You're going to find it's a little heavy. Now, leave your, leave your tool up here where you can get to it. Okay? Mm -hmm. I always try to... There you go. You can hang it off. And you want to get your fingers underneath this so that you don't... Drop. There you go. So you don't drop it. Once again, we've got honey on both sides. But it's not ready. Okay? Yeah. It's, it's good. They've, They've got, got plenty out, of stores. Yeah. You can tell we're in a honey flow. They're doing good. No sign of the queen yet. You probably won't see her up here above the honey line like this. No. Uh, well, I, sometimes you do, sometimes you do. Yeah, yeah. It's, a, it's a rarity, though, because there's no reason for her to be here. She's, no, she's, she's going to be laying. Next, next frame. Making them baby. See why we leave the tool up so you're not reaching all over the place all the time. And most of the time, when I get done with the tool, I'll lay it across the corner in front of me so I can see it. Otherwise, when you have tools and stuff get underneath you, you don't see them when you're working. And you end up dropping. There you go. You end up dropping stuff. Perfect. And I'm a beginner beekeeper too, but uh, now next time pull the frame towards you. Don't just lift straight up. You'll end up rolling the bees on this side, okay? That's a that's a pretty full one there, and they still yeah not yeah. There's tons of nectar, they're doing but good. they don't have enough cap yet. Yeah. So we're we're doing good. They're they're right on target. In fact, they're ahead of target. Whoop. That's a squish. Okay. Oops. That's when another squish. squish. Uh, I heard one. I heard a goat. When we hear that, we want to. Look. <laughs> yeah, we want to be careful. Now we bring the frames up. Always try to get these frames as close as you can. This is just propolis here. When you see this, go ahead and take that off. And the reason we want to do that is I don't like walking in front. We're just going to put that propolis down here. We're going to scrape that off. It can be a little bit tough. You want to take the other two off right there? And just bring them toward the edge. Keep your tool down. You're going to have to get a grip on it. It's hard to pull off sometimes. Now, we don't want to pound yet. We just want to, there you go. Just scrape. Keep it pushed against the wood. And if you don't, that's what happens. There you go. That's a better one. Okay. May as well get that one, too. Get all your cleaning done. Because when you go to open this box again, that's what your top was sticking to. Same here. Mm -hmm. They kind of glue it down themselves. Big time, yeah. Okay, now put your tool back over here if you're done breaking that loose. Be careful about jamming down in there like that. What you might want to do in the future, since how you seem to lose it a little bit right there, you might want to use the short edge, okay? And that way you can't go down to the bottom with it. Check your frame. Okay, we don't see a queen on it, but they're drawing it out beautiful. And once again, more honey. So you got four frames of honey up here. You're in good shape. Be easy, man. Yeah, just be gentle, putting it back down in there. Now, remember what I told you about holding it under the tips, okay? You always want to try and do that. That's usually where you'll get your bee squish at. You'll squish a bee by holding it under the tip like that. Be not careful. Now, these frames, did you get one in your... Walk yeah, away. You're good, you're good. Yeah. Let's go ahead and slide everything this way. Bring all of your honey this way to the middle. There you go. And just slide them all over. And they'll keep filling these frames out as we go. Now, in between, right there, I'm going to put a new frame, so they'll draw it out. Slide your next one over. This is called checkerboarding, okay? When you put a frame in between some frames. Uh, we won't do too many on that side. Go ahead and bring it. I just want to bring one in there. I don't want them doing too much, because they haven't capped any of this yet. I'm in good shape. There you go. Put your last one in. And then what I want you to do is I want you to center your frames up. Put your hive tool over here. And make sure everything is centered. Here you go. That's what happens when the guy that's showing you steals your tool. Okay. So you basically just want to use the tool to jimmy it like so, okay, on both ends oh, until okay. you get until you get the frames centered. And then when you get them center of the box, Just slide this. Don't pull them separate, because every time you separate a frame, you, you take a chance squish. on squishing a bee in between frames. Because Move them all at once. I want you to put the inner cover. Let me see your tool. Set it down. I want you to put your inner cover back on. The same side down that was down before. Okay. Try to keep the same side down if you can. Come on, bee. It's okay. It's, got, it's in bee space. It's, there's plenty of space in there, as long as it's not on the edge. And here's a little trick. Watch this. 
see that bead? You could very easily smash it. So why not just go ahead and start here and slide it on? Because once you're sliding it over there, he'll know yeah. you're moving. And then, and then when you get here, really be gentle because that's at the edge, and you never know if he's trying to get away or not. So now you're set, and that's good. Now we're going to need a place to set that so you don't get sand in here, okay? So we're going to put your lid down. All right. Take your hive tool, wedge under one of these corners. Just check for the edges and see if you can... The other thing is, is use your leverage. Let me see your tool for a second. I'll show you a little trick. I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to show you something. A lot of times what you can do is you can put the tool in like this. You see that? And then you can wedge it. You can use the leverage to break it loose. Okay? okay. So why don't you try that? Try putting it in all the way. Don't see. So don't peel the edge of the wood. Well, I want her to be able to see what Oh, that's doing. all right. That's okay. Bless you. Thank you. Bless you. Now, so far, we haven't even needed smoke, so... No. It's yeah. just sitting there and it's... Just burning away. Yeah. I think they're used to the, the being handled. And they're well, they are good bees, but you know what? At any time, that going to change. Yeah, it doesn't <laughs> take much. They, uh, you got a box put. full of females here. <laughs> Say what you want. <laughs> just, you know, do anywhere you want with that. Yeah. There's two there we yeah, sometimes it's not a matter of camera, it's just a matter of being. Are, are you saying we're all moody? <laughs> no, I had said nothing to say like that. I didn't hear that, did you? Hey. I'd never say anything to offend my wife. I love my house. You are about to knock that whole right. box oh, off. careful. You, you have okay. to be kind of gentle. Did you, see huh? it? did you see the whole thing shift? Yeah. yeah. Okay, how about we go back to where I showed you? Well, where there was I already a gap. got that. Okay, then, oops. then if you've already got it, then that's it right it's there. Loose. It's broke loose. Now you can take the whole box, grab the handles here, gently, take the whole box, and set it down. This is where it gets fun. Oh, look at there. I'm going to zoom. Okay, just set it down directly. Bend your knees. You're a doctor. You know this, right? Okay. Now you see all this propolis? Right here? You're going to have to do the same thing. You're going to have to bring all those frames this way. Those are all cedar frames, too. It's nice. Those Start with the tour already. and bring them all this way. Take okay. them all the way. Now you do the other side. Bring them all this way. Because they're already this way, so we want to just keep going this way. Yeah, you don't have to push it. Once you're done, there you push them, you're there done. You go. Now bring this one back. And we're going to go right back at it. And this time, this is brewed. So because it's brewed, we want to be real careful. That first frame, you're going to set out and set it on the edge. And make sure you do not drop it. You want to get your fingers under it good, get a good grip. And you want to keep, yeah, keep it that way as much as possible. We don't want to roll a queen. Now let's look at the frame before we do anything else. Yeah, you can tip it, that's fine. And I don't see a queen anywhere. I don't see a queen anywhere. And I'll take that and darker. set it out. Yes, it is. Older comb is going to be darker. It has the capsules from the uh, don't, don't sit straight from the bird. In a little. There you go. And watch the bees in the corner. Okay, please. now the rest of this, we're going to leave the frames in. So bring your frame towards you with the tool. You're going to need to break them loose. They've probably got propolis on them. And see, we're not smoking them. We're just letting that smoke roll over them. Okay? And we want to kind of keep a steady pace here. We don't want to go too low. Now, I'm assuming you're going to want to see the queen. So pick up the frame. Get a better grip on it. Go deeper with your fingers. You can actually yep. reach inside these edges here if you need to. Keep it over the box in case she decides to drop off. Set it down here on the corner. See that? Set that corner down on the on the middle of the frames here. Set the corner. The corner down. There you go. Now lean it back towards you. It'll be easy because there's just bees yeah. You only need to lean here. Let me show you an example. You only need to take one corner. Go ahead. Take one corner and lean it back towards you. Ah. Oh, and now you can see what's going on. Now this is mostly nectar, so um, they're not they're not doing brood, and there's there's nothing on here but bees, bees, bees. Okay, so we're going to take that. We're going to set it back down in here. It'd be a little tough to hand it to you, so I'll just go ahead. Yeah. And, and we want to be gentle setting it back down. And there we go. Okay, now work your next frame out. 